Hi everyone, and welcome to Timigate. In today's video, we are going to be talking about the Microtik Doot Server. The Doot Server is a powerful tool from Microtik that allows you to monitor the status of your network devices in real time. With all these possibilities that are available with the Doot Server, what happens when disaster strikes and your Doot Server goes down? In this tutorial, we are going to be looking at how you can easily back up and restore your Microtik Doot Server. So what you're seeing on your screen is a Doot Server that is running on a Microtik router. So we are just quickly going to look at how to back it up, simulate a crash environment, and quickly restore our Doot Server. I'm just going to bring on my Microtik router where I have the Doot server running so here is the microtik router you can confirm from the ip address i have on it is the same ip that i have running on the dude server so the first thing you want to do is to go to the dude section of the router click on settings and uncheck the enabled button so that stops the dude from running then we need to create our backup file so you type dude export. What I'm exporting is the database. Then create a backup file. And then this backup file, I'm going to call it TMG001 and hit the enter key. So this creates a backup file in no time. You see? Done. So to ensure that the backup file is safe. We need to download this so i'll go to file and here it is and i'm going to drag it to my desktop the download is done so i'm just going to delete every file i have here okay all the uh, backup previous backups that i have and i'll proceed to re-enable the dude apply an OK, and then restart the device. This is to simulate a crash environment. So once the system reboots now and we connect to it, there should be no file to load. So the dude is going to be up and running. The dude server is going to be up and running, but all our configurations will be gone so our router is fully rebooted but unfortunately on the dude even though we are connected there is nothing to display so this simulates a crash environment now it's time for us to restore the dude server so that we can have our configuration back so to restore the dude server we go to dude go to settings and stop the dude from running we go to file and upload the backup file that we created earlier. TMG001. It's fully uploaded. Now it's time for us to import it into the dude section of the router. We should have the dude back up in no time. We have imported the file and we have re enabled our dude server. So let's wait for the dude server to load and become operational. Now, as you can see, we have the dude operational. So, guys, that's how quick and easy it is for you to back up and restore your dude server. The dude server that we used for this demonstration was installed on a Microtik router. If you enjoyed this video, please do not forget to subscribe to this channel, like the video, give it a thumbs up, share, and also turn up your post notification to get notified when I drop new videos. 
Thank you for watching and see you in my next video.